This is a simple tutorial video on how to find Memo on your TongueKeeper app. And once you open your TongueKeeper, depending on what you want to do, whether you want to receive Ton or send out Ton or receive USDT or send out USDT, depending on what you want to do, it all depends on what you'll be doing on the TongueKeeper app. Let's say for example, I want to receive Ton on TongueKeeper. If you click on receive, there is no option of memo when you click on the receive button. And what it means is that you just have to copy your wallet address, you go to Binance or Bybit and send your TON or USDT or any other cryptocurrency that is built on the TON network directly to your TON Keeper app without imputing the memo. Let me show you an example of what I'm talking about. Let's say for example, I want to receive TON, I'll click on copy address, I will have to go to my Binance. And here is my Binance right there. I need to head over to my wallet. I need to have my cryptocurrency on the spot account before I can withdraw it. So I have Ton right here. Let me click on it. I want to withdraw my Ton. I'll click on send via crypto network. I'll paste my address on top here. I'll leave the network at Toncoin. You can see the option of memo. Binance is telling me to impute memo on it. But if you go to Tonkeeper Wallet, there is no option of memo. Now, let's go back to Tonkeeper to be able to confirm there is no memo. Now, we are currently on Tonkeeper. On the receive, there is no option of memo. It means that we'll have to continue our transaction without imputing memo on Binance. Let's go back to Binance. And once you come to Binance, you leave the option of memo if you want to receive Ton from your Binance to your Tonkeeper. You leave the option of memo blank. Then the option of withdraw amount you select the amount of Tone Keeper you want to withdraw. In this case, I want to send everything. I click on Max. Once you're done with that, you click on Withdraw. You can see the notification Binance just showed you. You can see, you did not fill in Memo. Please confirm that the receipt address does not need to fill in Memo, Digital ID or Remark. There is no need for us to do that because why? Tone Keeper does not have Memo option. So you just have to understand it and depending on the platform you're going to be using it's going to be a different thing if you are transacting or interacting with different crypto exchange they're going to require you for you to impute memo as you're doing it in this case i need to click on submit now this is where i need to confirm everything i'm doing the amount of tone i'm sending and confirming my address and everything i just click on confirm once you do this this is where you have to impute your security that you, you already set on your Binance, so you can actually send your turn to Tonkeeper Wallet. Now let's go back to Tonkeeper. Let me show also show you other things you can also do on Tonkeeper. Now we are back on Tonkeeper. Let's go to Home. But if you want to send your Ton coin or any cryptocurrency, whether USDT or Ton coin or any cryptocurrency that is built on the Ton network to Binance, you'll be needing Memo. Very important. Let's click on the option of Send. Or let's click on the option of turn coin you can see then you click on send now this is me sending my turn coin to binance using turn keeper app let's go to binance and copy the address i'm on binance right now i'll head over to wallet and i click on deposit and i have to select turn i have to click the network click on ok i copy the address I go back to Tonkeeper. We're in Tonkeeper right now. I have to paste in my address. Now you can see the option of comment. Now I am asked to put a comment. Now this is so important before you can actually withdraw your Ton coin or USDT from Tonkeeper all the way to Binance or any other exchange of your choice. Now let's go to Binance and copy our comment. Now this is Binance. Now it can be called comment, tax, or memo. It all means the same thing. But some platform call it different name. You don't need to be confused. They are almost the same thing. So you just click on copy. You go back to Tonkeeper. We are back on Tonkeeper. We paste it on the comment section. Then we click on continue. Now this is where you put in the amount of tone you want to send. In this case, I want to send all, I click on max, I click on continue, and I click on confirm and send, I click on continue. 
I have to put in my, my account password. You can see, sent. This is how to find your Tonkipa memo. Because Tonkipa, if you are receiving, you don't need a memo. But if you are sending, you need a memo from the platform you want to receive. Thank you for watching this video. If you got value, please like, subscribe, and turn on the bell notification.